Hey, what's up everyone? Pase Baller here. This is now the last game for today, January 8, 2024, NBA Game Day. This is a Western Conference war between Phoenix Suns and LA Clippers. This one will happen at 10.30 p.m. Eastern Time, so that's going to be 11.30 a.m. here in Manila. I'm just inviting everyone who have not subscribed yet to our YouTube account or YouTube channel, Pasay Baller. Please click on the subscribe button below. At the same time, hit on that bell logo. That way, automatically, you guys will be receiving notifications whenever new videos are uploaded. Approaching this game, Phoenix Suns, they got a record of 19 wins and 17 losses. While LA Clippers, they got 22 and 13. Both teams are doing good. Both are above 500%. Now, we all know that we actually provide free picks right here in our YouTube channel, Passe Baller. But for those who would want to avail our premium picks or premium packages, you might actually re reach us through Instagram, Telegram, WhatsApp, or even Messenger. Just check on the descriptions of these videos and you would see the details right there. By the way, the spread that is given is at minus 6.5. That's actually given towards LA Clippers. Well, LA Clippers, they would have the home court advantage on this. In terms of fatigue, well, both teams are coming off uh, games last night. So we can just skip that part. Both teams are actually um, a bit tired approaching this game. In terms of momentum, <laughs> well, both teams are also coming off losses. You know, Phoenix losing to Memphis while the Clippers losing to Lakers last night, right? But let's take a look at their um, uh, recent, uh, recent games or recent performance. For the Clippers, uh, for their last 10 games, they have won 7. For Phoenix Suns, they have won 5. So um, let's give the Los Angeles Clippers a slight advantage over Phoenix Suns in terms of, um, in terms of momentum and confidence. <clears throat> Alright, so let's take a look at the availability of the players and health of both teams. Starting with Phoenix Suns, um, I see Eric Gordon, Nasir Little, and Ball Ball, and David Lee. Um, all this uh, all listed out for this game. So four players confirmed out for the Phoenix Suns, and this is a great development because I no longer see KD. Right? Remember, KD did not play last night, and KD hasn't played for like three games straight, I guess. So it's going to be a huge development for Phoenix Suns, you know, uh, as KD is no longer in IL. Now let's go to the Clippers. For the Clips, there's only just one player listed down here. That's Musa. Um, so it's also a huge improvement for LA Clippers as normally we would see like a couple or maybe around three players in IL. Uh, so we got to give the advantage towards LA Clippers because they only have one player out for them as compared to four for Phoenix Suns. Honestly, I'm not sure why it's... Minus six point five that is given to Los Angeles Clippers. I know they have, you know, I know they have performed uh, better overall. You know, they got a better record for the last ten games. They have won seven. Phoenix Suns have only won five. But again, mind you, Kevin Durant did not play for Kevin uh, for Phoenix Suns for the last three games. So if KD played, uh, their wins for the last ten games would have easily been at seven or maybe even eight, right? Bradley Beal is actually performing well as a you know as a son. Um, Devin Booker he has been very consistent. Their you know their starting center is back Nurkic, so they're pretty much complete. Aside from the fact that you know Eric Gordon along with some some of their uh, some of their off the bench players are actually hurt. But for me, um, uh, Phoenix Suns with KD with the with the complete a big three that they have. Can actually go and take LA Clippers again. I don't. I don't really understand uh, the huge, you know, the huge spread, especially given to the LA Clippers, because there's even a possibility, as we all know, historically the Clippers sometimes would love to rest Paul George. Sometimes it will be Kawhi. So we don't know. Right now, I don't see any in the, in the IL yet for the Clippers, but I'm gonna go ahead and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and side with Phoenix Suns and take that plus six point five, um, if ever. Clippers will win. I don't, you know, I don't see them uh, having a blowout against Phoenix Suns, who got their big three ready league for this, uh, ready for this game. Again, my pick on this one would be Phoenix plus six point five. I'm expecting a huge game from KD on this after resting up for quite, a, you know, for quite a bit. Again, that's Phoenix Suns plus six point five. Peace out, pass I love, and God bless.